day two. We're walking in Hongdae. So something I noticed about Korea is that there's a lot more people smoking <laughs> and I see a lot more tourists in these areas. Other things about Korea is that pharmacies are more accessible. Like we just passed like one and it's like right near us. I remember when I was injured in Japan, we traveled the world looking for it. It was so bad. But I like it. It's and it's not even unbearably hot. Like I could wear a long sleeve and not cry. Let's see if you got it. Oh, oh. Also, the people's fashion are so nice. I found like three girls that wish I was wearing their clothes or their tops. My goal for this trip is just to try as many things as I can because I'm a picky. No, I'm just kidding. I'm picky. You're goddamn right. Oh my god, my hair is gone. Anyways, this katsu is the best I've ever had. It has so much meat all that, and it's so crispy. So good, so good, so good. 100% we'll come back again. Oh my god, 10 out of 10. Olive Young is so beautiful. I am a sheep. I bought so much. But my hypothesis is that I spent 150 or hopefully I spent less than 150. But I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight items. Welcome to the Olive Young haul. So I spent $130. So first item is this sunblock stick. She's a liar. Sunblock stick. She's a liar. Where the arms? Good. This is not mine. <laughs> oh, she took out the words. You did get the sunblock stick. That's though. mine. <laughs> I got these eyelashes to do this. Then I got a hair serum. Ooh la la, hair serum. For my frizzy ends. So it could be so cute. Then I got the sunblock stick. We all have it. I got <laughs> I got this sunscreen. It's lightweight, very clear, gelish. There's this style model that color. I'm looking for like a dark, a dark lip. I got this one and it, this brand was specifically recommended from Marcia. Felix's white. I love Marcia. And then I got the Beauty of Josen serum. And to be honest, I just bought it because I saw a really pretty girl advertising it. So I bought it because I want to be pretty like her. She's a consumer. I'm such a consumer. This, all of this was one thirty six. This is our first activity of the day. We're going to do some phone case making. Literally, I might make it ugly, but ooh, I want to do that one. I want to make that one. It's cute. All right, Habibis. So we're in the iPhone making cafe. We pay, we sit down, tell them the correct size of your phone. And then now we're going to go pick all the charms. Look at all the charms. They're so cute. I don't know what kind of vibe I'm going to go for. I kind of want to go for like a pink brown theme, but I'm also a star girly. So we'll see. We'll see how it goes. Okay, girlies, this is what I'm working with here. Now, to be honest, I started with a theme, which is card capture Sakura, but then I just started seeing everything that I really like, and so now we have this. So, hopefully it goes well. A few moments later. Okay, finished product. Overall, 10 out of 10. Very happy with what I did. Here's the guy. He is doing so good. I would hire him. And here's Ikea, doing her best, using the tools available to her trying to copy her own product. So as you can see, mine is like, you know, from that American Cookie Co kind of uh, icing with the colors pink. And then Ikea's going with a little purple theme and then Ryan got a little brownish. What, what color is that? Brown. White. Brown white vibe. Welcome to the mess hall of uh, Platform 9 and 3 Quarters Cafe. 
You can see my fellow wizarding wizards and witches. Here's one right now. Here's another one. That is where they put Dobby. Welcome to the unboxing of Stin. Look how gorgeous. It is Diamond B. Feast your eyes on the eyes of a thousand liquids. Okay, put your hands out, ladies. Put your hands out. Everyone gets one. I get one. And you get one. And you get We're one. there. Oh, you can beat the sleeve. It just a little goes a long way. I love glitter. Now I have glittery palms. How gorgeous. So gorgeous. This is a green tea. It looks like matcha though. Green tea is matcha. Huh? Hmm? Who knew? Okay, is it as juicy? Oh, I got invited. Well, it's great. Thanks. She bit it. She bit it. We didn't record it, but she bit it. Oh. Thoughts, ma'am. Can't speak. <laughs> Sorry. Lullaby for you. Be from your dream in a sweet place. I'm giving my review of this all you can eat unlimited pork belly. Out of five stars, I give it three stars. It's nothing special, but it keeps you full. She said 3.5. He said 3.75. My dad would love this. This one, how much? 15, $13 per person for all you can eat, bruh. That's crazy. Just came from Daiso, spent $40 on essentials, and now we're walking through the streets of New York City. AKA, <laughs> oh god. You can get coffee and cocaine all in the same street. No, for real. Like, you go, you go to a coffee shop? Uh-uh. They don't know what the fuck you're talking about. It's a Korean thing. I love that. What's a uh-uh? Um, ice and Because Koreans really like to shorten things by the first syllable. Oh. So, ice, Americano, uh-uh. Today was a battle. It was a big, big battle. Not only was it tripping over everything, but Lord... I dropped a pork chop on the floor and this lady gave me the side eye. She's like, I gotta pick this up and then this other lady gave me the side <laughs> eye. I don't even remember what happened before this, but then I put in this cup of noodle into the microwave. <laughs> and then oh, no. <laughs> suddenly oh, no. it started making light and then it made fire and then i was like holy crap we are gonna die but then i realized that you're not supposed to microwave it because there's spoil on the cover you're welcome <laughs> i'm right next oh, to yeah. the she the ikea saw my look of terror and she was like huh? Boop. <laughs> oh, no. nope. before uh anything terrible happened so yeah oh oh my god and we microwaved my gimbap and it was so hot Literally had to hold it in my mouth, and I was basically calling everyone. Ho, ho, ho. <laughs> I was basically, oh god, it was so. <laughs> I turned into Santa's daughter, Sanita. <laughs> paper towel <laughs> we thought we bought paper towel <laughs> got an ikea spilled something so we wiped it and i was like how come it's not okay, absorbing like, this is not absorbing it's anything. literally broken this is this is the thing you know like the steel wool used to scrub pants this is, this is it it's not even paper towel it's not it doesn't absorb it's what the this fuck is <laughs> all right right tell yeah. us what we're doing tomorrow Oh. <laughs>
Okay, so tomorrow we're going to the Coex Mall, which contains the library and also the aquarium. Uh -huh. And that night, we're going to go to the Bumpo Bridge to see the rainbow light. Oh my god. Fun! <laughs> <Yee>. <laughs>